Hey everybody, so I'm making this video with my camera because I want to show you around my little witchy area in my bedroom because I don't like it when it's out of my room and it just makes my room look very witchy and I love it because it brings the energies up big time. So I want to show you, I guess I'll show you my Aphrodite altar. Um, I have one for Aphrodite and one for Bast because those are my main goddesses. And I don't have a Poseidon statue, so I, I feel like it's weird if I make an altar for him and I don't have a statue for him. I'll be getting one soon, so that's good. Um, but then I just have my main altar that I usually do a lot of my spells with. Um, and then I have my little Book of Shadows area. But I guess I'll show you it. So here we go. Um, this is my little Aphrodite altar. It's actually in my little nook I have between my dresser and my closet. And I just got this Aphrodite statue. I love it. Oh, if you can't tell, she's holding doves because that's one of her animals. And yeah, I just have my candles for her. And my little incense and I have rose petals everywhere and some stones and a seashell. And then moving on to my little other area, my Book of Shadows is there. And I want to show you my new title page because I just finished it and I love it. So that's my new title page. I painted it all except for this part in the Triquatra that I actually put like scales in. And then the Libra Umbrum, which means Book of Shadows in Latin. And then I just have my little butterfly and then my tree branches all around it. I love it. And that's the little nook over there with my crystal ball right there. Um, but here's my main working altar. Um, I did a crystal pentacle with a, um, I completely forgot how to say that stone. Oh my gosh, I do not remember how to say it. But I have that in the middle. And then my athme and then my smudging stuff, candle snuffer, my goddess statue. And the candle, my god area, um, and then my incense, my loose incense right there. Um, and yeah, onto my best altar. So I have this amethyst cluster here because if you can tell, it's like with these stilts on it and it's really wobbly. So I have to have something heavy on the back and the front to hold it down. So, I just have that here for that reason. Um, and then I have a pendulum on each altar. I'll show you them all. Um, this is my Tiger's Eye one. Because of bass, of course. And then Tiger's Eye around it. And then incense. Two candles and bass, of course. Um, but that's her altar. And I'll show you the other pendulums. So, this is my clear quartz that I got while I was in Nashville. It's on my main altar because that's the one I use a lot. And then my other pendulum is this one that my friend got me. And I haven't used it that much, but I just think it's beautiful. And it's on my Aphrodite altar. And yeah, so... So that's my altar and altars, I guess. Um, but yeah, so it's... It's not even going to be like this forever because I'm going to be moving soon and I'm going to have a new setup and it's going to be a lot of work. But, um, yeah, so that's my altars and I hope you guys enjoyed it and see ya.